Hello there, this is Space Number 5. Welcome back to episode 24 of our Spain Let's Play series, where today we're going to continue down the Spanish mission tree. We are currently 22 out of 34, so we're just under two-thirds of the way there. We are currently going to go ahead and continue to devour the Commonwealth and maybe expand the Empire. Because right now we are gaining Imperial Authority. Um, once our heir comes to age, we will be available to be elected the Emperor. And right now, Bohemia doesn't have an heir either. So the current person would be Burgundy, who we could probably beat up pretty pretty bad and win the election back from them, obviously. So how old are they, just in case they do gain it? 35, so we'd have to wait quite a while. Let's go ahead and jump in here, since we did just go ahead and finish our war with the Commonwealth. Go ahead and continue influencing Brandenburg. I do not see a reason not to. In fact, we should probably bump up their trust with us. Since we do continue to give them land, we're going to try and form a Prussia from them. Although we don't want them to be too big, because I know that poses... Actually, that was in the... I was, I was going to say it poses an issue for our mission tree, but that was for the Austrian mission tree for countries being too big. That will not affect us. We just need to pass reforms. Alrighty, you guys need to be moved somewhere with a higher supply limit. And we do have an idea that we could take. You know, lower impact from stab costs. That means we can break our royal marriages at any time, which is very nice. We also get some new ideas. Anything that we would like. Uh, the extra diplo rep might be nice. What are we currently running? Global trade and settler chance? Ah, we don't need that. We make plenty of money. Hmm, let's go for the advisor cost. We do spend quite a bit of money on our advisors. Production efficiency, advisor cost, and aggressive expansion. No other admin policies. How about military? Anything that we're interested in? Not really. What are you currently running? National Manpower Modifier. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. I'm not going to lie about that one. Since we have a, we can have three-tenths of a million. Now that's kind of a weird demographic to state it that way, but 300,000. Commonwealth is the new pope. That means that we will probably be excommunicated. Hey, Pope Man. I want to go ahead and influence you real quick. I'll spend that 380 ducats to try and get your positive opinion real quick. And we'll also, uh, we'll improve relations with you uh, while, we're, while we're at it, too. Because you're friendly with us, but we could still be excommunicated. Because you have negative opinion with us. Oh, good, it's positive now. Alright, we can no longer be excommunicated. We're, oh, this is where we need to colonize? We'll do. Oh, looks like our colonial nation just started colonizing there as I looked at it. Good job, Brazil. Gain that mercantilism. Improve our trade even more. Uh, military leader has left us. Uh, he wasn't for the boat. So it's probably for this army, honestly. It's going in another new one. It's 6252. I'm not going to complain about that. Let's go ahead and drill all of our, our generals. Uh, go ahead and get them. Uh, hopefully uh, increase their stat from drilling. There's a small chance of that occurring. Uh, Ottomans, I have no interest in fighting you. Truce with Switzerland, or going back from the Pope Man. Any electors that we need to improve with? Platinate, we could probably improve with you. Yeah, we can get another 21 opinion. Be useful. Bohemia, you might actually vote for us. Let's go ahead and just... We're already improving with you. Saxon, you will never vote for us, just because you absolutely hate us. No, I might be reasonable. The odds of actually getting you guys to vote for us, though, are pretty abysmal. Hanover, why are you insulting me? I freed you. Hey, an extra Diplo rep. That's very nice. There you go, another colony going. Let's go ahead and colonize in the Amazon, just so we can fulfill our estate agenda. Ooh, can't colonize there. How am I supposed to colonize this? Can't send a colonist here. Does that mean we auto-fail? I can't, I can't recolonize this within reason. Alright, do we have a CBNU? No diplomats to send? Well, that can be fixed. Lose the 707 decades. Oh, look, one of our generals already improved. Ship the diplomats so I can actually see what's going on. Come on back from Bohemia. You. No CB on you, but Great Britain does, but 
Doesn't make a difference to me. Alright, well, we're just gonna fail that estate mission. Alright, let's go ahead and continue to colonize the Philippines then. We're gonna fail. Might as well at least do something productive. Bohemia does, still does not have. Oh, we lost another leader. Is it you? No. Definitely not that army. This guy. Take a new leader. 6223? We'll take for the improved uh, siege ability. That seems fine, appropriate. You're still coring. Let's go ahead and maintain with the Platinet. They're often not very happy with us. Let's do another autonomy change cooldown. Sure. Actually, I haven't done much of that in recent time. We have 61 universities. We have quite a few. Truce with, oh, military access canceled by Burgundy. Can't see why you would cancel that, but we do have claims on you. We could just beat you up for fun, but you're allied to Brandenburg. I'd like to avoid that. Because we're going to force them to be Prussia. Or just by giving them enough land, where eventually they'll just uh, form Prussia. That is a Burgundy. Looks like Bohemia just died. Yeah, you just died. Well, you guys have fun with that. That means you're the Emperor. Can't say particularly care about that. Brandenburg. In the reconquest of Galster. It's just part of the Empire, and Burgundy will protect them. Aren't you part of the Empire still, Burgundy? Yeah, you're an elector. Or Brandenburg. Who are we fighting? These little guys? Sure. I don't actually want you to annex any of these guys, so. Who else is in this war? Oh, yeah, you guys are stuck over there. That's fine. An army in the north? Nope. Okay. I have an army over here in Milan. Going back from Klebs. We have 200 opinion. Oops. Forgot to mute my phone. I'll go ahead and do that real quick. There we go. No more distractions. Our theologian has passed on. Can't say I, uh, I knew that we had a theologian. Alright, do we make more money off taxes or production? Definitely off production. We'll go for the level 1 here. And upgrade him if we can. We can indeed. There we go. That'll boost our economy a little bit more. Not that we, uh, need to boost our economy, but, you know, why not have more money? Well, we're only, oh, okay, I was like, we're only making four ducats. Quick siege. We got 30 of the ducats. That's not very much, to be honest. Who else is still here? Go to Wurzburg. Austria. Can you be annexed? You can be annexed, and we can also annex Great Britain. They're ready to be integrated if we improve relations with them, so I think we'll go ahead and do that. Just so we can fill, fulfill a couple more of our missions in the, uh, the new world. You guys can handle it. Because this will give us all of Louisiana, Newfoundland, the 13 colonies, whatever this little little bit of uh, California. Sure, we get another 27 decades. So we get a big chunk of the world, you know. They're calling in Colombia, Peru. So we'll get a big chunk. New cores, and this will be Lithuania that we'll release just so we can beat up the Commonwealth some more. Denmark and Canada. All right, you guys have fun. Where was the siege? I don't even know where it was. Oh, they took our port. Oh, okay, well, it's a bit disappointing. All right, this means that Gulster will still exist after we finish our fight. And we'll go ahead and colonize it, or convert that. And we'll come back over here to the Philippines and continue colonizing. Looks like Scotland has Australia, too. We'll definitely need to... We'll probably just take that from them. I don't think they need it, per se. There goes another siege. Alright. 
there's Great Britain fully uh, if maxed out opinion. Let's go ahead and do Austria real quick. They're probably pretty happy with us because we returned so many of their cores. Yeah, 200 opinion just for returning cores. And the Ottomans are sowing discontent in our country. Look, Ottomans, I have not done anything to you this entire game. And I get that you don't like me because we're apparently we're rivals, but... Who else is in this war? Frankfurt. All right, there. Here. Don't send the, another army. We only need uh, two armies there, not to be honest. These armies didn't even move. There's Bohemian and Thuringian separatists. Oh yeah, Thuringia is gone. I kind of like them to succeed then. All right, Burgundy, how old are you? 39. How old is our uh, our kid? Oh, there's the end of the war. Gulfstar still exists. We got seven favors. We are 14, so we got a little ways uh, before we can go ahead and take the throne. Oh, we already have two stack over there. Why don't you go ahead and go over here to the Commonwealth? Or to Magdeburg. I'm still baffled how we ended up with that, but got a free core on it, so I'm not going to worry about it. Alright, Great Britain. We'll go ahead and integrate you. This will cost 14 a month. We only take 12 a month, so we're going to be losing. Opinion of other subjects, minus 30. Opinion of HRE members, minus 25. Do we actually need to integrate Austria? I know we, we definitely need to do Great Britain. That's for... This one, we're still waiting on the workshop. That's why we're giving away most of our money, because I can't actually build that in Havana. Go ahead and give it a shot. I can't actually click here to open the build menu, but I can click it here. And there are other locations. Conquer the Aztecs. That'll just happen when we uh, do our many wars. This is Great Britain need to be annexed. This one's also Great Britain. 15 states, Spain owned by the North American and South American have assigned holy orders. Silamencia has a university. Sure, you can have one, might as well fulfill that since we're uh, looking at it. Four or five, Florida. Complete mission, three provinces you currently own, non-tributary. All right, so that's annexation of Great Britain. Colonize California. That's also Great Britain. Alrighty, so yeah, we just have to integrate Great Britain. We can keep Austria as a vassal, which I think is more than acceptable. We'll go and integrate them. They are part of the Empire now, so we'll take a massive hit when that happens. But beyond that, we should be okay. There we go, we have a 336 air. Not too bad. Definitely think that's pretty appropriate. Monthly autonomy reduction is also very nice, and huge treasure fleets coming in. Alright, Great Britain, we'll come and help you. Bremen, sure you can have access. Truce with the three leagues. Not that interested. Yeah. Everyone's going to vote for us. It's fantastic. Trier might even vote for us. All country. Wait. That, that's an important event. All countries with Protestant religion have their opinions increased by 35. All countries of the Russian culture will increase their opinion of us. All Catholics and Castilian provinces in Spain will receive. Ooh, that's not so great. Duh. I don't even know if I have an army that can access that at the moment. Nope. Where are the boats? You guys are currently moving that army. Look at Great Burn go, building up a bigger army to go combat their, uh, their rebels. Pretender rebels are just annoying. Do have some... Uh, Quite a bit of unrest, honestly, now. Most of Spain. Theologian might be a good idea, but other than that, we should be fine. Alright, we'll go beat up your pretenders for you. We'll help you out, Great Britain. Move the army over. Oh yeah, just full stack wipe. Why don't we actually just move this army closer? 
That way they can get back to the mainland too. Landed on this side. Wow, you guys took a ton of attrition. That hurt. Rebels in Austria, you guys will deal with that. No biggie. Great Britain's already 8% annexed. Right, let's go and take back this land. Admin benefits or military? Well, we have 72 army tradition. That's more of maybe. It's 47 with the navy. Hmm. Oh, admin. Don't really need the prestige. We're already maxed out here. Let's actually go and bump this up. So I don't really need the admin. Let's just go for military. 100 military points. Let's go and get another leader, just because we can afford it, and just so that way we're not wasting the 100 points, per se. I mean, we're going to waste a little bit, but that's okay. Take Diplotech. That was a cheap Diplotech, dang. Hmm. Is there anything that we need to improve? Well, we need to go ahead and have native reduction. 15 states owned by Spain or its subject in North America and South America have an assigned a holy order. Alrighty, well. Military it is. Go ahead and do the south. That was three, four, five. We already have the five in Colombia, so we need another five. Two more. There we go. That should be South America satisfied. Imperialism's caught CB. Oh, now we have imperialism. Perfect. Now we can fight pretty much everyone. Is there anyone that has land outside the empire? Yes, the commonwealth still does. You are very friendly with us. There we go. Get rid of those rebels. Can we demand more land? It's always nice to take land. We're up to 90. 90% 90 of all the land is owned by us. Oh, our commandant has died. Reinforcement, no thanks. Morale armies, uh, no. Give me something better. Month, month goes by. How about now? I'm sure, we can go for land maintenance, I don't mind. Go ahead and improve that. Our Diplo advisor, be level 5. Now nah, we can just do the papal influence, no biggie. We're going to be trying to bump up our stab, probably, with our Papal Influence. Ooh, maybe it's not a good idea for you to stand there. Everyone else can drill. I have a general, you may drill. We also have a spare general, not assigned. We just got... Oh, he has four siege. Nice. It's always nice to see. You can go ahead and drill up here. Apparently we're making tea. Awesome. Oh, a military leader just left. Where was he? He's here. Go ahead and drill. What is our professionalism anyways? Pretty high, it's 80%. Under population, nice. Alright, Burgundy, how old are you? Another 100 population is very nice. You are 41. We maybe just like declare war on you, have you as a leader, and then just accidentally kill you in uh, in battle. Imperial authority is not going down, which is nice. And the Platinum's not voting for us, because Saxony is not voting for us. We'll go ahead and get them to sway to uh, the right side. Good. All right, we can come back. Come on back from the Platinum. In the unrest, no biggie. We'll stomp it down. Commonwealth. Truce is not for a while. 1693, another four years. 
Venice, why are you taking claims on us? Good blockade your trade ports. Monetary reparation, it's pretty much just for money. Could honestly go ahead and try and convert some more princes. Notably uh, Bavaria. Scandinavia would join. About over here, Galray. Scandinavia, Frankfurt, and Lundberg. Where's Lundberg? Oh, they're Catholic. That's why I didn't see them. Normally they're uh, Protestant. Platinet, not interested in fighting you. Where's Berg? Platinet. You're Catholic. You have a truce? Holland. Bremen, Venice, and Lubeck. Lubeck is, should be Catholic. Venice, somehow you ended up not being Catholic. Farrar, you are the wrong uh, religion. Could go for you. Although you're allied to the Ottomans, I don't particularly want to fight them. The moment? Let's just go for a Holland, I think. Alm is not going to join. That's the wrong map mode. Alm is Catholic, though, so we're not too worried. Or I can go for the three leagues. The other one's not Catholic in this war, so I think this is totally fine and appropriate. Go walk over there. Bremen's Catholic. Yeah, we don't care. Stack white. We just need to siege down this one, uh, one fort, and the war will pretty much be over. Jared, who are you fighting? Holland, Bremen, all Venice, and Lubeck. Gotcha. Another military leader has left us. Go and get another one. We can afford it. New profession level of professionalism. Who else is incorrect religion? Dith Martian, who are you allied to? Avignon, East Frisia, and Memington? Yeah, we can go ahead and declare that war as well. Burgundy, why would you join? Who are you allied to? What happens if I call Brandenburg in? Yeah, I don't want you assisting. Alright, you're in the war now. You don't get to help the em Emperor. Right, you go over there. I'm just gonna go ahead and invade. You can go ahead and split off a couple guys from them, probably. Alright, who else is in this war? Memington. Let's go over there. Honestly, they have armies everywhere. Okay, apparently France has some colonies. Good job for you. Probably just take them from you, to be honest. Who wants to join our war? Brandenburg wishes to join this war as well? By all means, Brandenburg, join the war. All of our... Uh... Everyone's at with us. Should be fine. Oh, you lost a leader. No, don't put the king in charge, because that's how we end up dying, we get a regency. Make him upset, I don't, I don't particularly care. You guys will deal with that. Let's actually go to war for the, our Mexico provinces that we need. Sure, have everyone in. What did get black flagged? Got black flagged in Bavaria. Alright, well. Go there and then back up to, uh. Is it Bagdeburg? No, it's Rothberg now. Magdeburg's up here. Yeah. You look at the map so many times and you can still forget where stuff is. You are Protestant. Oh, but you're the war leader. Go to East Frisia. They're Catholic, though. Going back from Saxony? Who in this war is not Catholic? You're Catholic. Florence. Aunt. Aunt, you are not Catholic. 
go over there after we've sieged down the capital, Burgundy. Oh, well, actually, I guess we can. Uh, no, Burgundy, get off my fort. It's mine. It's my fort. There's your capital, Burgundy. We actually force you to split off anyone, like Lorraine or something. Got Provence. Provence is over here, though. Could take these two provinces and then force them to move their uh, capital inside the HRE. Could be something we do. You're free city, you're Catholic. Get, get out of the war. Siege of Memington has fallen already. Well. You, my friend, are now Catholic. Welcome to the wonderful world that is Catholicism. How do we end up with a war with you? You ally, yeah, you're allied to Burgundy. Well, we'll make you Catholic too. Bohemia does, still does not have an heir. Provence, you want military access? You fighting anyone? No. Should you be fighting someone? Maybe. More manpower. It's not like I needed it. There was another fort from Burgundy. Guess what, Hunt? You have a new Bible now. Welcome. Still ally with the Platinum. Let's go over to Avignon. The Siege of Chur. Hey, this is for the Three League War. Gotcha. You're Catholic now. Yeah, I really don't need your money, to be honest. But, I'll take it. If, you'll, if you're offering, I'll take it, I guess. Don't need to force my arm or twist it, so that way I'll take your money. Just take it. Get out of the war. Is there anyone else who's ca not Catholic? Galray is not... Frankfurt's Catholic. Lindbergh is Catholic. How about Brunswick? Oh, we're already at war with the Emperor. Fine, if you insist. You guys are doing a little bit of carpet sieging down here, just being a nuisance. But other than that, not a bit too big of a deal. We're gonna force you to be Captain Catholic. That's a level six fort. We should probably upgrade some of our forts then. Become a level six fort. You. Go level six. To be honest, I, f I forgot the level six forts were around. Definitely a level six mountain fort would be nice. Milan gets sieged down all the time. Here goes your capital. You're kind of a big nation, though. You, you might not. No, can still force it. Take it a 42 opinion. A reason. Nah, spare no expense. Burgundy. Can't force you to actually release a nation. Can force you to give land back, though. Give land back to Provence. This one province? then I can eat this from Provence, and they'll be forced back into the Empire. Sure. Be gone, Burgundy. Ew. This will get to war with an Elector. You're not the right religion. Yeah, Provence, we'll go ahead and go to war with you then. Burgundy should be around for a little while, so. You got Black Flag, go over to Anjou. Utrecht. You're Catholic. Get out of the war. Florence, Avignon. Doesn't want peace, but you're getting ready to get stack wiped.
Sure, you can have military access. Oh, our colonial nation can actually fulfill our own objectives. I didn't know that. Well, thank you. Still working on that fort, dang. That is a very long siege. Montferrat. Really only want one thing from you. I want you to be Catholic. That's it. Treasure fleet. This is a little bit of inflation, but other than that, I'm not too worried. Who else is in this war? Go to Lundberg, just get him out of the war. Mains during the fight. Oh, I wanted to see how long that siege was, because that was a long siege. Just give me all of it. We won't worry. There we go, continue siege. We'll help with this, this one. We can bring our two cannons. All right, we're getting ready to max out on our uh, admin. Let's go ahead and we're still making 137 ducats. Uh, are we not giving away our 100 ducats anymore? No. Okay, well, we can totally give that back. Fonts. You're about ready to take peace. Uh, Switzerland, we definitely need to go after you. Before it's going to take a little while. Go over to Burn as well. Is it Burn or Bean? I always forget. Alright, Avignon. Get out of the war. Seize that down. I just gave it to him, but... There we go. Monferrat, you're ready. No money? Okay. I don't need your money, but sometimes it's fun to take it. There we go. Dith Martian, you are ready. Force your religion. And give me a little bit of money, sure. This war is pretty much ready to, to end. We don't need this one province, we're not going to worry about it. All right, Mexico. You're looking a little bit bigger. Still have some claims. I'll go after you then. There's the siege of Lundberg. What do you say about getting out of this war since you're Catholic? down here to Mainz. I guess your capital's over there. Can we split anyone off of you? Thuringia is definitely can get split. Mainz proper. Nope. Aztec Conquest. 800 ducats and gets permanent claim on the Mexico region. Sure. Five states in the Mexico region. Well, we definitely got a surplus of military points at the moment. Can't do that because we don't own the full thing. One, two, just took that. Three, four, and five. Owned by Spain. Did that miscount? Maybe. Means I believe you're Catholic. At least Thuringia. Get out. Thuringia is Catholic now. Awesome. Adds uh, another prince. I like having extra princes because it helps with the imperial growth. Look at that, we're gaining 0.02 right now. Saxony is getting ready to vote for us. Even though you are the wrong religion. And you're very tiny. Probably, uh, force you to convert, to be honest. Working on, uh... Maybe we don't need 
150k standing the same province. Just maybe. It might might be useful. You are the wrong religion. Where are you at? Right here. You're ready to peace out. You get a new Bible. Alright, who else needs a new Bible? Rothberg, you're Catholic. Already. Switzerland, you need a new one. Can't actually force you, so we're just gonna try and relieve you of some of your uh, your clay. Saxony, can we declare war on you? Take your capital. We'll wage a quick war. You're not gonna like us very much, but that's okay. We're not actually taking land, we're just forcing you to convert. You can get out. We get 69 ducats, fantastic. Rainberg, are you even helping in these wars? Russia does not have an heir. No, he just came to the throne. That's right, we could have pushed a PU if we wanted, but we chose not to. Can we release anyone? Does not look like it. I don't particularly want land from you, I just want to convert you, but can't. So get out. Go and walk over that way. Already see you now. Baden. Who is the wrong religion? Good job, Austria. It's a good eye. Yeah. Oh, he did die. That's a sad day. Alright, you need to do Diplo Advisor. Let's go for Diplo Rep. Can you let that roll? Getting ready to lose a uh, relation that is currently costing us. Yeah, we'll go ahead and annex that. Goodbye. You. You're a vassal of who? Can't say I cared. Uh, another colony is self sustaining. Let's go ahead and send our colonist out once more. We should probably try and convert our. our Colonial nations, that's uh, quite a bit that we'd have to convert, though, honest. England is still converting, very slowly, or not being converted, being integrated. Do spare admin points, let's go ahead and bump stab. Bump it twice. It'll be well worth it. Helps us with our conversion, because each stab gives us half a percent for conversions, or missionary strength, rather. Which does add up over time. Boo. Make sure you force the religion. I'll go on board, Baden. Provence. It's really all I want. Nope. Is that inside the Empire? No. Well, which one would you add? This province has... 1322 development, and this one has not not enough. Okay. That means I need to take three provinces. These three. These three will do. Used to be owned by the Pope, but the Pope no longer has a core on it. They have a claim, but no core. We'll go help with that siege. Alright, Avignon. You ready to get out? Actually, we'll go ahead and send that army then. Ooh, I just know looked at the time. Um, that is all the time I have for today, so if you enjoyed today's episode, please like and subscribe. Have a good day.